tonight sorry about the uh, I think that we must give a round of applause for the cleaning lady of hotels and motels come on they're my favorites not firemen not, not policemen not, not bridge surgeons the, the, they are they're, they they see a lot of shit they see hell man when they go to my bedroom oh there's one one little detail that I don't know if you can help me they always in the end of the, the cleaning, they leave a triangle in your toilet paper. Oh, what's, what's the story with that? Are they Illuminati? What's the thing? What's triangle? They arrive to my bedroom, they see the TV crashed on the floor, several pieces of things in the bed sheets, and the dead hooker in the bedroom. Oh, wait, I have to make a little, little triangle. On the floor. What? what is it's so thoughtful. I think it's sweet. It's very sweet. And what about the, th the towels? What's with the towels in the bedroom? Because one of them is not a towel. One of them is a floor mat. And I never know which one is it. You're with me. I end up cleaning my face with the towel. Say something next to your feet, man. It's gross. It is awful. Oh my god. It's, you don't have to, have to tell anyone because, the, well, the top thing that could happen is the mat, the, mat, the floor mat thinks, oh my god, what clean feet, what soft feet, oh, you have a bubble in your, oh, I've been promoted. <laughs> and talking about suntan, I have a sister, and this is another thing that annoys me. We have the same genes, she's my sister from uh, the same mom and dad. But when we, go to the, when we go to the beach, two hours after we arrive, she's so tanned. She looks like Miss, I don't know, Mozambique. And I look like hemorrhoids. It's this, does anyone suffer of, no, no one? No, you're sitting down, of course you don't suffer from hemorrhoids. But this is very, very strange because in the end of the day, we, we pass on the beach, like six hours later, I wouldn't be surprised if Angelina Jolie came up and adopt her because she's so tense. It's, it's amazing how nature works. Well, I have some thoughts to share with you. It's 
It's crazy because I'm blonde, I know. But, <laughs> but I have some one-liners. you know one-liners? One-liners are uh, very short and uh, quick <laughs> thoughts that I want to share with you. And uh, well, this is a moleskin. This is the, the, the this is something that you write on if you think, oh, I'm intellectual. <laughs> I think. Well, here we go. This is sex sales, but when I go shopping, the salesperson is always a person. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay, don't don't don't. <laughs> The rhythm, okay. The only thing I hate in karaoke, karaoke, karaoke. Okay, the only thing I hate in karaoke is when other people sing. Just one thing. Thank you. Just one thing. If you think that eating bugs is exotic, well, you don't ride a bike, do you? Kids, that's an idea that I can't conceive. <laughs> but if I had twins, I'd dress them matching clothes, but I'd introduce seven differences so the family could have fun. <laughs> they say it's impossible that two snowflakes are alike. Who's comparing? Get a girlfriend. <laughs> irony. You know what irony is? Irony is analgesic, means painkiller. But it starts with anal. <laughs> I hate to wild rice because it's so hard to catch him with a fork. <laughs> What's so surprising about finding water in Mars? If they find tequila, that's surprising. <laughs> my family is so small, I'm planning having my geno genealogic bush built. <laughs> I thought that losing a pet was the saddest thing on earth until the day I lost my dildo. <laughs> I hate it when I spend hours preparing a good cleavage and the guy only looks me in the eyes. Hello, they're down there! <laughs> Just my best friend. Dad was so mad and maniac about games that he named his two kids Player One and Player Two. <laughs> People love happy endings, but be careful, it stings in the eyes. <laughs> well, about jobs, people, this is the, the theme of the night. Uh, if you think you, that your job sucks, just think that you could be a gynecologist in Bangkok. <laughs> oh, that's closing in with a golden key, isn't it? <laughs> I'd like to think, uh, well, I have, I have to brag about it now. I have a brand that uh, it's designing my clothing, my accessories, it's uh, material lab. And I'm very happy because now I have one brand of clothing that dresses me and five brands of cachaça that undress me. <laughs> Thank you!